Jeez, that's a big wave. We don't know what the future is. We lost power and we're taking on water. Open your eyes, Danny. We're gonna survive because we're fighters. Josh, Wild Bill, Jeff in Las Vegas. Thank you for joining me today. What's going on, Jeff? I love it, man. I love it. Oh, thank you. Season 18 of Deadliest Catch. Man, Josh, I watched you growing up. <laughs> I, I, I talk about feeling old. You know, I'm going to have to go out to Red Lobster tonight to celebrate. <laughs> Man, my whole adult life has been on TV. How crazy is that? It's awesome, man. It's, it's been a pleasure, though. So uh, congratulations you, to both of you for season 18. And, you know, Josh, this season, State of Alaska canceled Red King Crab season. Can they do that? Why did they do that? Uh, well, obviously, they can do it. <laughs> That's what it happened. And uh, why did they do it? Well, they tried to find the, you know, uh, correct amount of numbers of crab, male and female species. And, you know, they were a little light on the female species. And so uh, they just decided to let them sit on the bottom, kind of repopulate and do their thing. Could have been bad tests. It could have been uh, that the population needs to kind of replenish itself. Who knows? But what we do know is that king crab season was shut down, and that put us in quite a bind. I, I can only imagine. And while Bill, 20 years fishing, you know, you are uh, just an, an incredible season, uh, experienced fisherman. What keeps bringing you back every year? Well, it's 43 years, not 20, and uh, survival. I mean, it, I, I can't see myself retired just yet. I, I hang, my, all my life is with people half my age, and a lot of people are pretty amazed at how old I am because it's just tasting music and activities, and I think being on the boat keeps me young. And, and Josh, Golden King Crab, bigger payday, but it's four times deeper. How hard is it to catch that payday? Well, I'm not going to necessarily say it was a bigger payday. And yes, four times deeper. I mean, like, that's where like Dr. Seuss's nightmares live down there. You know, it, uh, you see some weird stuff, but uh, we didn't really, by the time we got the hang of it, our budget was out. <laughs> so, I mean, I don't know, but the boat's still afloat and I still have a crew. So there's a good thing, right? <laughs> Absolutely. And Wild Bill, how did you earn your nickname? Is there a story behind that? <laughs> um, I can't tell you that. Multiple. There's multiple stories. <laughs> Actually, it was either Wild Bill or Stupid Bill, if that gives you any indication of what the stories might be. So I went with Wild Bill. It's a little easier to take. So there's no clean family version of how you got your nickname? <laughs> oh, no, no. It's, it's been a cumulative. <laughs> and Josh, it's been going did... on for since I was little. Oh, <laughs> that's awesome, you know? <laughs> Uh, and Josh, uh, deadliest catch bloodline, warm water fishing in Hawaii. Will it become a reality? Uh, well, it has become a reality, and I'm in Hawaii right now as we speak. So, um, you know, it's it's been a very interesting ride. And, you know, right when you think you know a lot about fishing, you don't. I actually had to even phone a friend, that guy sitting right over there, Mr. Wild Bill, <laughs> you know, to get educated on a couple of things. And, uh, you know, Bill always has got a guy, man. And... <laughs> If I ever got a question, Bill has got an answer usually. And, uh, you know, I had my older brother join us, and that that was pretty cool. I haven't seen him in you know, a couple of decades. And my younger brother was there for a bit, you know, kind of helping out the situation. And, you know, Mr. Wild Bill came over and helped out. I mean, you know, I want to accomplish this goal. So my dad wanted to do it when, when he was still living. And uh, now here I am, you know, chasing down that dream. We're on year season three of that and still plugging away up here in Hawaii right now. So, well, 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 Bill, like you said, over 40 years of being a commercial fisherman, why wouldn't you just spend your final years in Hawaii? That sounds like the ultimate place to fish and live. Well, I actually, uh, for the last 23, going on 24 years, I own a home in, down in the Mexico on the Sea of Cortez. So um, geese have small brains and they go south when it gets cold. So <laughs> I, think, uh, I think I'm ahead of the curve there. <laughs> yeah. oh man well you know awesome. josh if i'm going to learn how to be a fisherman i think hawaii would be the ultimate learning experience so uh you me and wild bill let's all get together and uh head out to hawaii and uh I i'm a sponge you know i'll learn anything you tell me if i'm in, in that beautiful area now right now currently i'm getting ready to go down to vegas um I've are you <laughs> with, uh, 
with down damn berries downtown yeah i'm gonna be no kidding uh, you know uh so i'll be down there next week so we sell some of our product there it's one of the first places that uh, we sell our fish that comes from hawaii down to vegas and there'll be a couple more places soon but right now we're just servicing that one restaurant it's a mega restaurant over in circa and um you know i tell you what that barry the owner of berries is on the show with us and Boy, that guy is intense. Yeah. <laughs> so you went. But he has a great restaurant, man. And uh, and that's it's kind of cool because that's, that's one of the only places that we sell our product currently. That's and, incredible. Because Vegas, you know, is the is what the ninth island, you know. We got uh, more <laughs> Hawaiians here outside of Hawaii and anywhere else. So you're you're more than welcome. So well, gentlemen, congratulations on season 18. It's been a total thrill. I've been watching. I can't believe I've watched every year. I didn't realize it was 18 years, but this is just one of the most incredible shows. Wow, Bill, thank you for joining me today. You too, Josh, and I wish you best of luck. Hey, thanks, brother. I hope you have a great afternoon. Thanks for having us. You bet. Take care.